In today's video, I'm going to unbox this Amazon Fire Stick light. Uh, I got my son to pick this up for me. It was, I think, $40. He said around $40 Canadian, August of 2021. So I'm going to set this thing up and uh, see what I can watch. And hopefully I can get rid of some of the crap that is on my television so the contents of the box are as such a little booklet there feel free to read that uh, here's our little quick instruction manual and it lists what we have so this is our fire stick fire tv stick light Got a little usb micro usb connector there on the side, there. oh, that's the power. Okay, it's marked power there. All right, we got that, and our HDMI extender cable. What do we get there? That's just the USB cable for the power. Get that end on it. Standard HDMI and this is the remote. I assume that's what the two batteries are for. Let's see. Alrighty, yes, that is the battery. Click that in. That in. See if we have any sign of life out of this. Mm hmm. Yeah, we'll go through the instructions. So I have a... Batteries might be dead. I don't know. And our AC power adapter. We need to plug our fire stick into a spare port on the television and use our HDMI cable to plug into the fire stick. So you've got this type of connector, plug that into the side of the fire stick, HDMI port one, number one, is spare on this television. If I can get it in there without knocking the camera over. Okay, so now that's plugged in. Take our cable. Plug that into our power adapter. And I'm going to plug that into my AC outlet. They've included an HDMI extender in the kit, and the next step says to use this if you have any problems plugging the fire stick into your television. So let's use that. So we do, do it like this. Then plug that into HDMI one. There, that was a little, little more room there. Uh, microphone, it says. There's your voice button. This is the navigation button and the select. Uh, your back, your home, menu button, rewind, play or pause, fast forward, and guide. Now we have to put our television to the HDMI port that we put our fire stick in, which as we saw was HDMI one on this television and select that HDMI one fire TV. That looks promising. Okay. Now 
the instructions tell us to hit our, I think that's our play pause button. And it tells us on the screen also in some other language other than English. So I'll hit this. Aha, okay, English and oops, this is our up and down and this is our select. So let's go to English, United States and then select that, configuring your Fire TV. Uh, the instructions told us to get the password for your interweb. So I've got that. Okay, Bell 3, oh, that's my network. Let's try that. Aha! This is where I'm going to have to pause. I'll be back in a moment as I put in my secret password that I got off of my router. I shall enter that and we will be right back. So that took about, I'd say, 15 minutes, and then this screen came up. Sign in with your Amazon account. Okay, I entered the secret password, and now it is downloading the latest software according to our screen. I will mention to you, when you enter, enter your password, and you're going back and forth, left and, you know, to enter your, uh, the password, there is a menu where you select the digits. Now, I got the password incorrect the first time because I didn't no notice that my letters were being entered lowercase and there were uppercase letters in my password. And to get it to uppercase, the screen is gone now, but it's just basically a big screen where you're selecting either numbers or letters. And in the, I think it was the left-hand lower corner, there was a little symbol for an uppercase A and a lowercase A. And if you select that, that will change the the case of your uh, letters. What do we got here? Fire TV, installing the latest software. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let this play and I will get my YouTube editor person to fast forward if this takes an extreme amount of time. I have a Netflix account, so I'm going to try firing up Netflix. So let's just start with our home button and then arrow over to Netflix and then I'm going to select that with the big round button and what do we got? I'm trying to hold this so you can see the remote at the same time so I'm going to arrow over, or do I arrow down? Okay, sign in. And now I'm going to try to log in with my account. So here is my Netflix account. So now I can watch Netflix on my television without needing uh, okay, so here we go. Basically, okay, so that's it. That's enough of that. Oh, yeah, Seinfeld's on here. That's good. Hit enter to go that. All right. Now I am going to load up YouTube so I can watch YouTube on my big television here instead of my laptop YouTube All right over here on the left we see get free download I guess that's for YouTube itself okay I think we're highlighted on that big round button there we go downloading all right, so it's installing the YouTube app, obviously. Hit the big round button again. Yeah, looks like it's 
Doing something, okay. What do we got here? Alright, this is just random stuff, I guess. Eh. Mr. Bean. Let's try this.